franchise history. 19 years later, they were trying, finally trying to get to 100. Could Trent Dilfer lead him there? Well, Dave Craig gets a fumble, and Hardy Nickerson recovers. What a strange play, Tom. And Chris, when I played against Dave Craig, his hands are not as big as some of the quarterbacks in this league, and about two or three times a game, the ball is going to do just that slip right out of his hands. Bucks now second and goal from the three, thanks to the miscue. A little blitz by the Bears, but Eric is into the red zone. Tampa Bay leads it 14-7. Second. Now watch James Burton get knocked out of bounds on a punt. I mean, he only goes about 20 yards out of bounds, and he comes inbounds. Now, this would be fine. He stays away from the ball. Let somebody else touch it. Oh, that Mr. Burton, he decided to touch it first. The ref was right. He was out of bounds, so they have to re-kick it. Boy, would it hurt. Carl the Truth Williams takes it in the 12th. Have a good go. He could go all the way. 88 yards. 21-7. Buccaneers. Tough hitting game. John Lynch lowers the boom on Curtis Conway. Right there. Yeah, you're going to see Lynch come over in the double zone. Conway beats the coverage to the outside. Nice hit by Lynch right there on the sideline. Now, Dilfer's on a couple of touchdown passes. Michael, come on, Hosta, who's dead? 50-yard feel real good. The Bucs have scored 31 points in the first half. That's the most in any half at any time in 21-year history of the team. And Tony Dungy, hey, you get the ice bath if the team wins number 100. And certainly much signs of improvement for Tony. Marcus Allen, stuffed by Sean Price, second and goal. Play action, Bono out of Keith Cash's reach. KC settles for a field goal. They led 3-0. Bono won for seven for nine yards in the first half. Third quarter, Chiefs lead 9-3. Bruce Smith, great stunt inside. Hurdles Dave Zott, strips Bono the ball. Phil Hansen recovers. Bill's in business. They trail 9-6 early in the fourth. Kelly looking for Thurman Thomas. Went over 1,000 yards for the season. 28 yards on the reception. The Bills Second and goal. Kelly looking to cash in. Tony Klein, first touchdown of the season. Bills lead it 13-9. 7-18 to go in the fourth. Not 7-19, not 7-17. Steve Bono. Looked like he got tipped at the line of scrimmage. Chris Spielman picks off the gift, takes it to the KC 40-yard line, fumbled it out of bounds. Bills ball. Tough day for Bono. The INT set up. Kelly, Quinn Early. Bills win it 20-9. Bruce Smith and the Bills headed back to the playoffs. Yes. Marty Schottenheimer looking for 500 finish, and Jeff Blake looking for 500 yards in the air. He's looking for Carl Pickens. 52 will do. That will set up the Cincinnati 7 0 touchdown. Still in the first, Bengals are driving again, but here's Blake, and here's not Richard Belzer, but Jason Belzer. And he takes it back 21 yards. We're tied at seven. In the third, Indy trailing 17 to 10. There's Harbaugh. Long bomb. Off stride to Marvin Harrison, not a touchdown, but nearly. We're tied again at 17. In the fourth, Bengals, second and two. Nice short arm by Blake to Pickens. First Bengal in history to have 100 receptions in a season since you have 24-17. But then the ensuing Colts punt return is Aaron Bailey. Bailey? Which Bailey? And they're not going to get him. And we're tied again at 24. Aaron? Please save your self-congratulation for the end of the game. Bengals first and 10 from the nine. Blake to Tony McGee. Bengals ahead again, 31-24. Colts, though, have one last shot. With six seconds to go, here's Harbaugh. Nothing open, jump ball. Gerald Dixon pulls it down. He plays for Cincinnati. Bengals win 31-24, and they finish up 7-2 and two under Bruce Coswood. 8-8 eight eight overall, still their best record since 19... Could beat his old boss. The Panthers would. Speaking of old bosses, Kevin Green hits Mike Tomzak in the end zone. It's an intentional grounding and a safety. 9 0 Panthers. Now watch this. It's a punt. It's still live that the mascot forgets or decides he wants to be in the highlights. Bill Cowher thought it was funny. The ref, Dick Hantak, did not think it was funny. You, you'll be suspended and wipe that stupid look off your face. And Cordell Stewart in at quarterback for most of this game for the Steelers and showing the versatility that could make him someday the National Football League's MVP at any one of two positions, maybe three. An 80-yard touchdown scrambled, the longest by a quarterback in NFL history, 14-9 thirds, fourth quarter, 18-14 thirds, fourth and goal. Stewart hit Ernie Mills, and Ernie Mills hit the good zone. Just plain old dropped it. Next drive, less than two minutes to go. Key third and seven. Stewart, Stewart takes a look. and Andre Hastings. A great scoop in interference there, so we're now first and goal at the one. 
Oh, but it's raining flags. Brendan Stey called for a false start, and then Cowra, a good craftsman, never blames his tools. So it's second and goal on the same drive, as Bill says, think, or something to that effect. And now Stewart has no protection. Sean King, the other team's quarterback, must go down. He must go down hard. Third down and goal, one last chance. Stewart to Hastings. Didn't get to Hastings, got to Chad Cota instead for the interception. But a great move on Hastings, and the Panthers clinch the divisional title 18-14. Only the third time in 14 years the Niners haven't... Nothing first quarter, Brad Johnson armed with a new contract, finds Chris Carter. Chris Carter, 76th career touchdown reception. We're tied at seven. Second quarter, Brett Favre, Antonio Freeman, and that is Corey Fuller coming up right there. Let's look at it again. In fact, let me see it twice. Corey Fuller. I don't think Antonio saw him. What do you think? Third quarter, Packers first and 10 from the 13. Favre to Dorsey Levens. Great block. Frank Winters blocking. 17-10 Packers. 24-10 Packers. Fourth quarter, Favre looking for Keith Jackson. 31-10 Packers, Favre, did you say MVP? 39 TD passes, that is the most ever by a quarterback not named Marino. 38-10, the final in this one. Ball, Jets 38, Kareem Abdul-Jabbar hit by Matt Brock. He fumbles, Hugh Douglas not only picks it up, he's got designs on taking it 62 yards for the score, Jets up 7-0. Jets led 21-14 third quarter, and it's Jabbar again. 30 carries, 152 yards, gets 17 here. He becomes the first Dolphin since Delvin Williams to go over 1,000 yards. The Jets don't die. Fourth quarter, down 10. Frank Reich in a QB, looking for Wayne Krebet. This has got to make Leon Hess happy. Yay. Nice gesture by Krebet. Gives the ball to Kotite. And then another nice gesture. Wayne Krebet gives the ball to Terrell Buckley. The Jets user-friendly. Tough loss for Rich. He will have no more as the member of the Jets coaching staff. 31-28, your final. Jets become looking good early. 7-0 Oilers until Vinny looks for Michael Jackson. 86 yards, one of three touchdowns on the afternoon for Jackson. And we're knotted at 7. Or 7-7 seven, seven tie. Oilers hanging tough. They're up 17-7. Third quarter, Steve McNair. For Steve McNair, just over the 20. Looking, 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 not looking, scrambling, scrambling, scrambling. And he's, he's in for a touchdown. 24 yard touchdown. Oilers hold on to win it by the final of 24 to 21. Houston won. Second play of the game. Mike Mamula. Mamula. First quarter touchdown. First career touchdown. Late in the second quarter. Eagles up 16-3, Ricky Waters, 23-3. Second half, Boomer Sison replaces Graham. William Fuller would like to get to know Boomer. Fuller, Fuller, after his three sacks. Late in the fourth, it got ugly. Eric Hill stuffs Waters, and then the Dennis Rodman trick. Ricky's not happy. Under 10 seconds to go, Esiason needs 29 yards passing for a $100,000 signing bonus. It's come down to this. Larry Centers gets 12 yards. The clock runs out. No bonus. No bonus for Boomer. No win for the Cards. 29 iron head. Drills Jeff Lagerman. And then takes it out on his helmet. First quarter, no score. Mark Brunel continues his Steve Young impersonation right down to the number. 7-0 Jaguars. 16-10 Jaguars as we move to further action because the highlights are better. Mike Hollis, 42 yards out. It is post time, and it's good. Fourth field goal of the day, 19-10. Safe lead for the Jaguars. Well, maybe not. Ironhead, 19-17 Jaguars. 19-17, Falcons get the ball back. Bobby A. Bear to Tyrone Brown, and he nearly broke this one. 23-yard gain. Morton Anderson warming up in the bullpen. Third and five. A bear. Jamal Anderson, a gain of six. Morton Anderson, no relation. Pacing. Clock winding down. A bear positions the ball perfectly in the middle of the field. Morton Anderson, perhaps the greatest field goal kicker in NFL history. And he pushed it left. It is from 31 yards. There's the snap. The place with the kick is up. It's on the way. And it's no good. It's no oh good. It's no good. Mark oh Anderson is missed. And the Jaguars are going to the playoffs. Morton Anderson had made 59 consecutive.
First play of the third quarter, Raiders leading the Seahawks 14-13. Billy Joe Hobart meets Sam Adams. Heck, the head on that. The Seahawks recover in three plays later. Gino Toretta, there's been a Gino Toretta sighting in for Stan Gelbaugh, who was out with a groin injury. There were more groin injuries than fans at this game. Toretta to Joey Galloway for a touchdown. That's right. Same score, Napoleon Kaufman coughs it up. Corey Harris recovers seven turnovers by the Raiders. Mike White wins the, or loses the, Seahawks Raiders, who get fired first bowl. The Raiders. Executive sellout. Fans came out to hail the Redskins. Sonny Jurgensen, the victory cigar before the victory. Art Monk, the great receiver. Dexter Manley on hand. John Riggins sharing a few laughs with Sonny. Riggo's blockers, the Hogs. The RFK faithful still loving the e Troy Aikman got the day off. So did Emmett. Fourth quarter, Terry Allen. He would break the Skins' single-season rushing record held by John Riggins and then said, take me home. A piece of RFK with him. And then Barry uh, and the Cowboys in Fuego. The RFK faithful saying one final thank you and goodbye to the place the Skins called home. Still one of the greatest venues to see a game in, particularly a playoff. So remember, no way. Oh, don't get hurt. Anthony Miller becomes the third NFL quarterback to throw for 45 billion yards. All right, 45,000. Denver would lead 10-0 later in the first. Elway under pressure. Uh-oh. Oh, he fumbles, and he's down. He's down. Seau recovers and gives the ball to a fan. It's souvenir ball day. Second quarter, Denver 10-7. Seau playing with an injured knee. Terrell Davis fumbles. Not hurt. Seau, another souvenir. In the fourth quarter, Bill Musgrave hurt. Elway out. He looks on as Jeff Lewis in from the stands. Throws an interception, and San Diego goes on to win, but Elway can taste the playoffs. Davis rushed for 21 yards and nine.